So today we're gonna be doing some math. And when we do these math problems, you gotta make it focus a little. The stupid thing ain't focusing. Sorry, y'all. I'll do my nails. So when we gonna be doing these math prob okay. When we're gonna be doing these math problems, I'm gonna show you an example right here. We're gonna show this example right here. So it's 9 over 21. So you're going to find the factors of 21. And when you do find the factors of 21, it's going to be 7 and 3. And then the factors of 9 is 3. So basically, what you're going to be doing is you're going to take these numbers Take the 9 divided by, I mean, 9 over 21. Then you're going to put it over here, over the same thing. It's the same thing, and then you're going to divide it by these two numbers because they're common, you know. So you're going to find out what is 21 divided by 3, and then you're going to find out what is 9 divided by 3 equals 3. So, y'all, I'm sorry. I'm talking. So, 21 divided by 3 is 7. And then you get your answer right here. This is your answer. Right here is your answer. So, I'm about to show you another example. Sorry, y'all. I'll do my nails. That's what my nails look like. <laughs> y'all, these nails popping. It was popping, but I'm getting off the track. I'm sorry. Um, so we're gonna do the other bad problem, which is you're gonna see this and then you're gonna put it over here, as you see. It's so already put over there because my math teacher she already did it a little bit, like all the examples and stuff. So she already did the examples. Sorry, my phone is acting stupid, but. You gonna find out what the factor of four is. The factors, the factors of four is. So you only get two. So then you gonna find out the factors of six. And then when you get the six factors, when you gonna find out the six factors of six, you gonna get two, two, three. Then when you get two to three, nah. Um, when you get two to three, you gonna find out which one is the most common. You're going to find out which one is the most common here. And obviously, it's 2 right there. And it's 2 when it's... Common means common... Mon. Means... Means when exact the same. Same. Actually. Same. So, common means the same. So, if common means the same, these two got to be the same. So, then, when you do that, you're going to take these two numbers, put them over here, and then you're going to take this one, put it over there, and then you're going to divide it by two because this is the common number. So, you're going to divide it by two, and you get blank. So, do that problem for me. I'll wait a minute. Okay, you did the problem? All right, then. So, Neo, I'm about to do one on my own and see if y'all can follow along with me. So, I was already doing one, as you see, but I'm going to skip along to the next one. So, um, I forgot how to do it. All right. So, let's do this one because it's more easier. As you see, it's more easier. So the factor of three is, I mean the factor of, yes, the factor of three is, uh, let's do the factor of six and, yeah, let's do this one. Okay, this one is going to be two, two. Okay, y'all, I'm sorry. My phone acted stupid. I didn't do my other nails yet, um, because I didn't really feel like it. I was going to wait until these ones dry, because, yeah, 
But right now, but we um you gonna find this one. Then when you find this one, this one right here, when you find it, you gonna find these two. And then When we're doing this, actually, here's the factors right here. Okay. So, when you do that, you're going to do the 6. 6 over 8 right here. 8. Then, when you do 6 over 8, the two common numbers is 2 and 2. So, you're going to divide that by 2. And what you will get, hold on, y'all. Let me go get my calculator. I'm bringing y'all with me because I need a flashlight. So, let's go find my calculator. If it's not in my room, I'm going to have to use my tablet. So basically, I'm still looking for my calculator and trying to see where it is. It was kind of cute, y'all. I'm not going to still looking for the calculator. I'm sorry, y'all. Oh, these two tablets we got. Then we got a laptop. Let me get my tablet. Y'all remember, this is my tablet, so I'm good. And this one, 100%. Look at that. Now, let me find my calculator on here. Okay. So, I got my calculator. We got two tablets up in this piece, and we're getting another one. So, when we got our calculator... So basically, what we gonna do? We gonna look for six divided by two, and that equals press three. So you are gonna put that as the numerator, and then you gonna clear this off, and then you gonna do this one, which is. 8 divided by 2 equals 2. Y'all, this one was easy. I didn't even need my calculator. I was just waiting for y'all. Mm -hmm. Just waiting. Uh, all right, y'all. So, that's your answer right here. That's the answer, y'all. 3 over 4. So, now my camera wanted to focus. So, here's my... um. Here's my thing now. Here's my thing. Oh, this is crazy. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm trying to make a focus on my pencil. Look at that. iPhone pen. iPhone camera, huh? I could I could blur things out too on my on my camera. What you got on me, iPhone, huh? Huh? Right. Nothing. But anyways, y'all. As you see. That'll be it for today. Make sure you like, follow, share, subscribe, all of that. Uh, and I'll see you next week. Bye. Potato scans.